Hello and welcome to the tutorial on comparing numbers. In this tutorial we're going to do numbers up to 10. But we're not going to use pictures and we're not going to use the number line. We know the numbers up to 10 so this should be a relatively simple exercise. Let's look at our first example. Let's suppose we have the numbers 5 and 3. So we got numbers 5 and we got number 3. Now do you recall the three symbols that are used when comparing numbers? We have this one here, the equals, and this one here. So which one do you think goes between number 5 and number 3? Now which one is the smaller number? This is the way I do it. Let's find out which one is the smaller number and then we can add one of these which points to the smaller number. So the smaller number is well, we can count up. Let's count from zero. The first number that appears, either this one or this one, is the smaller number. So we got zero. Count with me. Zero. One, two, three. We have it. So three is a smaller number. So the arrow has to point at three. Five is more than three. The arrow is pointing at the smaller number. Now let's work through another example. Let's suppose we have number 4 and we have the other number is 8. Now again, I'm sure you can work this out. Let's see which one is the smaller number. So which is smaller, 4 or 8? Well, the smaller number, well, let's count again from 0 upwards. The first number that we come to is the smaller number. Is it going to be 4 or is it going to be 8? So 0, count with me, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Number 4 is the smaller number. So the arrow has to point at the smaller number, which is 4. So 4 is smaller than 8. 8 is greater or larger than 4. You can say it the other way around as well. So that is the correct arrow to add. Now the third example, I'm not even sure you need this. You're going to know this very easily. Let's suppose we have the number 5 and we have another number 5. Now they're exactly the same. So it's not less than, it's not greater than, it has to be equals. Now you didn't need me to tell you that. You already knew that. That was nice and easy. So that is one way of comparing numbers up to 10. All you do is simply count upwards the first number that you come to is the smaller number and then make sure the arrow is pointing at the smaller number.